Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Jim, how are you reading the formation? Well, one of the attacking advantages in this setup, Peter, is the impact that can be made between fullbacks and the attacking wide players. These combinations, when worked well, can be a real handful for any opposition, and we're likely to witness that again. You often see the wide man drift inside to allow the fullback to make the run out wide, and it can just throw the opposition off kilter. And if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Great run on the overlap here. Throw it. Tries to stroke it through. It's come loose. Had a shot. Across the field it goes. Across the line, and it's a throw. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. What an adventurous run from a defender. it back and the defense can get it clear Copenhagen have opted to really stretch the game now has a hit tries to get it clear over to the left dinks one in a reprieve albeit perhaps momentary No, that's not the ball he wanted. And he's a short goal! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Forward it goes. He's got through. It is deadlocked. Looks to clip it forward. AGF get it back again. Boylison. Jorgensen. Jorgensen drives it forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Done very well to intervene. Jorgensen. Copenhagen going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Hoists it forward. Over hits and out of play. Boylison. 
until half time, and it is still goalless. And that's clear cut, that's a free kick. And here's Fisher. Out to the right. And there's the end of the first half. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. So they head in no further forward. The score here still 0-0. Second half gets underway. AGF can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Finds himself eased off the ball. Chip through. Gets the better of his man. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. And it's played forward. Well intercepted, really alert to the danger. It's gone for a throw in. And the weighted pass knocks it away. Plays a clever pass. Delivered. He's had a goal! Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. Yeah, and all engineered, Peter, by some smart running and movement. That's already something to admire, but how about the pass? Just wonderful. Loved it. AGF draw first blood here. Well, we certainly had to wait for it, Peter. Now a difficult decision. Is it stick or twist? Place it over to the other flank. Back into the middle. And it's got through. Drive it. That's a pop! It's broken loose. Copenhagen are definitely going about this the right way. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. And that's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Plays it out to the wing. Fisher pumps it into the area. This was gone, that's a foul. And there's obvious upset over that challenge. You can see the players face to face. Let's hope this doesn't escalate.
And that has been cleared. Copenhagen are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Goes long. Has he picked him out? AGF are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. He goes long. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed. But will they? Jürgensen gets into the right position to intercept. AGF need to hold on for a few more moments. Tries to get it forward quickly. Going nowhere fast is about the only way I can describe this. They've just got to be busier. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Goes for the cross. That is good defending. It's been repelled. Could move up a gear here. Floats one over. Keeper's got good distance on that. And time is up. OGF, win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. Well, this game looked to have nil nil written all over it, but credit to them, they upped their game in the end, and I thought they got what they deserved. And that's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you all.